let's play. Josh Calhou with more Blue Dragon. Okay, so last episode, we finally got the Garbo plant in the Forest of the Dead, and we are ready to hand it in. Gee, I'm being welcomed back like a giant among these dudes. Maru Fini. You really got the Garbo Leaf? Wow, Maru, you are great. Yeah, he's great. They all they, all their names start with like Maru. Maru Tora, Maru Mira, Maru Mini, Maru Pony. You're not a pony. <laughs> anyway, let's go inside. Daddy! Mommy! How do you feel? Any different? Any better? Take it easy, Maru Maru. Don't you remember what Kluk said? It would take a good night's sleep for the medicine to work properly. Really? Then everybody's gonna get well tomorrow morning, right? You're sure, right? 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 <laughs> yes, they're gonna be fine. That's gonna leave a mark. Kluk? Jiro? Kluk and Jiro aren't here. Where could they have gone? Where indeed? Oh, it's weird being the only party member. Oh, can't see anything. Ah, oh, curse my TV. You know what? I'm. Wait, I already, no, I already turned that down. I was gonna say I'm gonna turn it down, but I already turned it down, so. I'm. not having much luck with this TV. <laughs> Well, it is pretty dark, though, <laughs> so it's not all my TV's fault. So we're in my room, it's like the basement of Maru Maru's house, is sleeping, and then, um, he's still somehow asleep after, like, falling off his bed, falling on top of Shu, and then crashing into the wall. He's a pretty heavy sleeper. <laughs> so, um, it's kind of dark right about now. So we can continue the, um, G-Bats, continue the cutscenes by going... Somewhere actually, where do I go? Oh, right. I'm going the complete wrong direction. We need to go back to the town hall Not over there uh, Which is uh, the, the town has like these things you can ride like Slightly down it's far <laughs> the whole animation just takes so long. It's faster to just walk around and you gotta like you look at that, oh no thanks, and then you go around and go like down and like hold the control sticks. It's like <laughs> continuously rotate the camera <laughs> to go down the winding stairs. Okay, here we go. Kluke? I've mixed the medicine for tomorrow. Thank you. I've always wanted to be a doctor, ever since I was a little girl. But I have to say, I never expected I'd have this many patients. I know what you mean. Yeah. Well, at least everyone's sleeping peacefully. But it seems like you're not sleeping very well. You haven't been sleeping either, have you? Well, um, you woke up and I was worried, you know? Thanks. The truth is, I'm really scared. Scared? Of when morning comes. 
Because we'll know if the medicine worked or not? Yes. When Dad treated the victims of that sickness, I was maybe eight years old. I can't help wondering, what if I remembered it wrong, you know? It'll be all right. When Marumaro begged me to tell him if the medicine would work, all I could think about was, what if it doesn't? I mean, that's when it really dawned on me. I have all of these lives in my hands. The thought of it makes me too scared to even sleep. But you have to get at least a little sleep. They'll still need help tomorrow, after the worst is over. That's so sweet of you, Jiro. I'm just worried about you, you know? Thank you. You do everything by yourself. You try so hard. Mm. I mean, when other people are around, it's okay to cry if you need to, because I... You're right. I heard you sometimes cry when you're alone. What? Shu told me. He knew about it? Tears can ease your sorrow. So go ahead and cry as much as you want. That's very kind, Jiro. People, show your gratitude! That's some pretty basic dancing they're doing. Do the step and point your fingers dance! Um, <laughs> well, obviously that's the dance of joy because, um... Finger pointing is very fun. <laughs> so we're gonna have a chat to everyone for no reason. I'm truly grateful for all the help you gave to Marumaru, yes. Haha, <laughs> look at this, I can hold up the queue. Ah, <laughs> now they're all stuck. Haha. <laughs> I'll let let them keep going. I can even like hold up a single one. What why am I doing this? <laughs> so now you go to the back of the line. No wait, no, you're the front of the line. Alright, that's that's better. Now they're in order again. <laughs> Come dance with us. Okay, I'll, I'll I'll dance. Step, step. I can't make him wave his fingers. So no, I, enough of that. L let me go. <laughs> enough dancing. Thank you very much, all of us. Yeah, truly, saviors, Devi. Yes, 
If you ever, ever if you are ever in need, please call us on the telephone. The sewage don't exist. We will do everything in our power to help. Uh, yeah, so an English song and a Japanese song back to back. Um, that's kind of interesting. So uh, we're pretty much done with this place. We can just walk out. Yeah, I've, I've had enough dancing. Just walk out and they'll stop. <laughs> Got a few more cutscenes. There's actually, um, well, I, I would say two side quests we can do here before leaving. Muru, Muru, oh my gosh, come with me. What is it? What is it indeed? I hear you did well, Maru Maru. Yeah, thanks to them. Maru Maru, look at this vase. Yeah, what about it? I just pulled it out of the bottom of that fountain. The fountain? Just look closely, Maru Maru. It's got the same exact mark as the one that's on the drill machine that that old man gave you. What? <gasps> then that means Nene caused the sickness in the village after all. That bastard! He's gonna pay! Marumaro, leave the rest to us. Huh? Hey, we've got a score to settle with him too, for what he did to our village. Huh? But, Maru Maru, your parents are all right now. Your work here is done. What could be better than having your family safe and sound? Well, yeah, but now it's time for Maru to help you guys! What? what? It was only Maru's village that was saved, so everything isn't okay! Take Maru too! All right, let's go! Okay, yeah. <laughs> hey, since, since we're in uh, his village, I guess we should run around as him, huh? It's kind of weird using a shorter character. So I'm going to try and leave. That's going to initiate uh, another minor cutscene, and then we'll be able to do some stuff. And where are we going? First, we go home. Good idea. To the village, right? Yes. We need to tell our village about Nene, and make plans for how to fight the land shark when it returns. Marumaro, do you know how to get to Talta Village from here? You bet! You bet! We gotta go through Go Mountains! Through the Gull Mountains? <laughs> Marumaro is right. <laughs> that is the only way back to Talta Village. Learn this dance before you leave. Really, I mean, there isn't even a boss there. Oops, spoiler. <laughs> uh, okay, so yeah, the um, until we initiated that cinematic where I tried to leave, the de the Devi tri tribe chieftain was actually missing from the village. So let's have a talk to him. Please feel free to use any of the treasures of this village. Hmm, could it be you're already using them? Huh? No, were we? <laughs> never mind, never mind. Use them as you like. After all, it was you who saved this town. It's the lock opening dance. Jeez, they do a dance like everything, like, um... <laughs> I have to use the internet, better do the... <laughs> connect to the internet dance, Oh, Yeah, but they wouldn't have internet here, so... Ah, whatever. <laughs> Go on, take what treasure you will. So, uh, yeah, we... Can now open these treasure chests, and they all have somewhat useful items in them. Like, you know, they're not potions, they've got... Like, rings and equips in them. Not that rings are anything special. Uh, blah blah. So what do we got? Water, silver, magical silver. Um, 
So let's all deal. May poison a target at that attack physically. Uh, MP. Yeah, he can have it. So I, I guess I'm I'm counting this chest opening thing as the first side quest, and the second side quest, uh, we actually have to completely explore the village looking for um altars that Maru Maru can pray to, and we get a, another item for doing that. Where am I going? <laughs> So let's just, um, they're, they're in like pretty much every house. I think the one house, there's one house that has two, and that's the only one. I wouldn't remember which is which though, so we're just gonna have to look and all. So yeah, uh, the accessory shop, you get a 20% discount now if you, um, want to buy things, which we don't really need to. So, ah, uh, yeah, here. This one, yeah, there'll be some in here. Going into the houses, like, it has to load, and you have to see this animation. It can be, like, slightly annoying, but uh, this is really the only time you have to do it. So here we are, here's an altar. Oh, it's an altar, Mara has to dance. Dance, do you usually dance when you pray? That's right, look! The Devi Dance of Prayer! Your prayer has been heard through this altar. That's like it. That's like a nice like take a picture. Of <laughs> I see that's pretty good. Shoo, the pilgrimage isn't over yet. Pilgrimage. Yeah, after praying at all the altars, Maru offers a final prayer at the temple. That's the Devi Tribe pilgrimage. Once a pilgrimage is all complete, a good thing will happen. Okay, let's try it. Which well, gee, it's a lot easier than a pilgrimage in another game I'm aware of. <laughs> Final Fantasy 10, by the way. So you can examine stuff, there's nothings. Nothing. She three nothings in a row. Nothing. Wow, four. This house is like, th these guys must be poor. <laughs> so you can actually go down another level and uh, there might be another one down here. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so this is the only one, this is the only one that has two. And yes, we have to watch him do this after everyone. Mara hasn't prayed to this altar yet, the Devi Dance of Prayer. Prayer, you there. Two of them. Mara still needs more dancing. So yeah, Shu counts, Mara dances. Ooh, there's a chest here. Shadow Crystal. I'm not really using those that much. Um, Yeah, that's all that's down here. Back up we go. So, just to save a bit of time, we're going to uh, start cutting. It's because we have to like climb out of this house, like, all the way. And... Load twice. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, we won't cut this one, because I was talking during it, so all the other ones, I guess. It's a pretty short stop between houses, too. It's like, uh, yep, just, uh... Uh, this is the item shop, so nothing in there. And just up here is another one, so down we go. Here's a temple in here. A pff, temple. Altar. That's not much of a dance, either. He's just waggling his fingers. Three. Uh, this has a second floor too. This is Mara. Mar is this one Mara Mara's house? I think so. I mean, that's why his parents are here, right? <laughs> and nothing in the second floor, but I should have known that because we were here earlier. Okay, so that's uh, that house. Now just um, can't go in there, and I uh, can't go on this one either because um, I don't know. <laughs> I hear voices. Devi Hermit, you look like you're doing quite well. Still, I'd rather stay at home. Oh, well, I'm sure you would, Hermit. So, yeah, there's only a couple more, I think. Although, there is another chest that got unlocked up here. Yes. Here we go. What's in this one? Flame bracelet. So, um, just pretty much another elemental bracelet. We've been getting a lot of those. I don't even think that's worth equipping, though. Oh, we may as well look. Oh, wow. Well, I'll look after we get the third opening or box that opened just over here. Item. Ordeal earrings. So, two ordeals and a flame. No, I don't want skill. I always pick, like, the wrong thing. There's so much options. Uh, so, like, instead of earth, we've got... Yeah, so that's, like, five... I guess it's got MP, so I should put that on, like... Kluke or something because she needs it now. What was the other one? Ordeal. Earring. Wind, magical death, water, wind. 
uh, less agility, more defense, and prevents the poison status ailment. So he doesn't need that. Um, who do who don't I want to be poisoned? Uh, yeah, Kluke, why not? Not that um, that's that important or anything. Okay, so just a couple more houses over this way, and that'll be all. There's only six altars, by the way. Plant lover's house, huh? Well, we've got one here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finger waggling. <laughs> That's four, so two more. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I suppose the interesting thing about this house, though, is that if you go down another floor, there's no altar, but you can examine every single one of these flower pit things and get, like, an interesting item from each of them. Like a curing item. item. Phoenix Talon. Item. Mental Surge. Item. Magical Medicine. Item. Deodorant. Oh, f yeah, because that grows on trees now, apparently. Item. And Antidote. How useful. Oh, there's a bed here, too. Gee, this guy sleeps around all this trees, all that. I guess that'd be sort of nice. Okay, so the next one is this one. Ooh, the young couple's house. Oh, this is funny. <laughs> They're not even doing anything that bad. They're just like hugging. <laughs> By any chance, did you see? I feel some kind of power rising inside of me. Um, I did not need to know that. HP's are restored. Why? Why even? I don't know. <laughs> I want this. I want to check out this sword rack. Let me see. I want freaking. There we go. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, I knew there'd be nothing because there's not a sword in there or anything. <laughs> we can't use those. That would be too powerful. <laughs> so this is number five. Join. And this house doesn't have a second floor. Okay. So just um one more to go. This is the last one. So it's got last one's got to be in here, right? Old man's house. Yeah, he definitely is old. Thanks, Maru Maru. We are in debt to the Telta folks now. Oh, I suck at reading. <laughs> yeah, so this is the last one. They're <laughs> so interested. That makes six of them finished. This is the final altar. Does that mean the pilgrimage is over? Nope. Last step is to pray at front in the in front of the town hall temple. Town hall it is. Let's do it. Join. Let's do it indeed. Nothing, Nothing in there. <laughs> Medicine, nothing interesting. What is this? Agility plus one. Well, um, that's actually a stat boost. Who's who's slow? Um, I don't know. Shoes slow. No, he's not really. But I'll still give it to him because I don't. I don't know who to give this stuff to. Gold. Gold. Wow, I'm robbing this old man. That's Item. so mean of me, stealing his garlic. What if he wanted to cook something with yummy garlic? Now he can't because I'm going to consume it later or sell it. Because I'm such a bastard. <laughs> so yeah, now that we've saved the village, you may notice that a, um, the music started playing, which is sort of like a non-lyrical um, version of the song that was playing when we uh, saw the village as being cured. That's huge. What is this statue of? That's a statue of the Devi God. It's a really old piece. Wait, wait, did I read that right? I wasn't even looking. <laughs> so that's a Devi God. <laughs> yeah, there's something wrong. Well, not particularly, but you guys really worship some strange things. Looks more like a devil than a god. So what? Are you making fun of Mara's god? Maru, Maru, I'm sorry. We're, we were wrong. Each of our cultures has its own values. That's getting um, lessons from Jiro. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Sorry, Maru, Maru. But look, but now that you mention it, this god is a little scary looking. Prayer, damn it. <laughs> we finally made it. This is the last one. The Devi Dance of Prayer. Well done, you prayed at each of the- and every altar. Well, the thing's talking to me now? Jeez. Here is your reward. Fire ring. So, uh, yeah. This is probably the easiest way to get the fire ring. Um, I think there's probably another way to get it, but I'm not really sure of it right now. So, because I remember when I was, uh, 100%ing this game, I had to do this to get the fire ring, so I was missing that. So, um, there you go. <laughs> if you're missing the fire ring, that's... do that side quest. 
but um, I think we're pretty much done for this episode. A shame that we didn't get to even <laughs> we're in the village the whole episode. But I suppose next episode we're on our way to the Gull Mountains, which um, ugh, as as every single area I say, <laughs> the same thing. It's sort of mazy, but it's not really that mazy, and it's not really that long either. But the monster fights can drag on, but uh, good thing for you, I'll be cutting most of those. So, um, see Marumaru's sort of disappointed face next time. On the next episode, thanks for watching, take care till then.